Happy Wednesday, guys. Welcome back. Today, we're teaming up Krillin Chew uh, with GoGo -Go Gum. It's something I did in the past, but of course, GoGo -Go Gum's been buffed, and we're pairing it both with uh, the floating device, because floating device basically cancels uh, your animations uh, when you use uh, the certain moves, so it's very nice when you can actually uh, use them while you're kind of moving in and in. So generally we want to use these like during the time machine phase. You can use them at any point in the game, but um, it's just not that great of a thing to use out in open battle, right? It's specifically kind of like meant for um, time machine fights, but we'll see what we can do with them. I'm very excited to go, 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 got buffed. Um, you know, Krillin Shoe still has its place. I still very much enjoy Krillin Shoe. Um, but let's see if we can use both of them pretty well. At least I'm pretty sure Go Go Gum still works, um, the same way with, uh, Floating Device. I believe we can just move and shoot it. I guess we'll find out the hard way if it, <laughs> if it doesn't. Alright, more gloves, a lot of Zenny. Two keys, pretty good. This is a pretty high level Ginyu, so... You know, we gotta be a little careful. Team's uh, talking with pings, so good on them. Hmm. Thanks. All right, first D change going on. I wonder if they're gonna actually try and fight. I got level two, I could join in on the fight. I do have grapple here. Do we want to kill him this early? I feel like we just do some damage and run, but we try. I think my job should be like getting rid of all the civs right now. Yeah, there's already three people using D change. We we shouldn't be. Come on, guys. I'd, I'd rather not have Raccoon so early, but okay, a lot of civs up here. Start getting these. Yeah, there's two civs right here. Let's go get these before Raccoon gets these guys. All right, we managed to kill Goldo. No annoying scout roaming around the map, but now he's Raccoon, and he could probably hurt a lot of us very easily. Flying across the map super fast. Someone save me! I was just—I honestly was just thinking about how to nerf the Ginyu Force, and most people will say like, um, like I think we all agree that Jason Birder's Key Blast can be nerfed with either range or damage. And most of us would be okay with that. But I just realized, like, what if Raccoon took well, four sieves instead you. of three sieves? Three sieves doesn't get him uh, there completely, but it gives him, like, yeah, I think you have to wait, like, around 10 seconds for it to uh, get him to Jason Berger. So I was curious if, like, maybe four seconds. But I feel like that might be too much. Like, that seems like a very strong move. But... You know, they've been... Ginyu Force has been here for a long time, so... People are getting used to him. I just, I just think he's like the. He probably is. I think holds the record for still having the easiest, being the re easiest raider in the game. It's, it's not hard to win with him at all. Like I said, the win condition just has to be uh, Shenron. I'm gonna take one of these. I think there was still a Civ um, in that direction. I'm gonna grab this so we at least have Shenron somewhere. Okay, so he has to be down there because it is not up here. Oh god. This is not good. Okay, he ignored me. He's going for someone else. He has Dragon Balls. Now would probably be the best time to take him. But I think getting the time machine going is a little better. Let's use this and try and get a scope of D here. Come on, Key, where are you? Not in the water. It's got to be out there in the middle then, huh? That C key needs to be placed, guys. There it is. Where'd Raccoon fly off to? There he is. This is not good. That's a new power key. Place it now. Right. Oh. All sieves are gone. Great. We just don't want people to go down now. 
Looks like he's going down. Let's start getting these keys then, boys. It looks like Rayo might be on the Seeky there. Oh, probably not anymore. That's fine. That's fine. I don't think he's gonna, like, I mean, <laughs> I always try and find ways, like, I think 99 and keys are gonna work. Because, like, let's say I 99 that, he might not have the, or feel the need to camp uh, C and D, because, you know, C and D are roughly close to each other. But, and there's that. Oh, man, the issue is we gotta get these. No one's over there. Okay. Regardless, if we can ping pong them back and forth between these keys, we'll be good. Yeah. I'm close. I'm the only one that can get the dragon balls off of them. So. Let's see if you can keep up with me. That's annoying, but we're chilling. All right, he got the balls off him. I gotta do my part. Just keep him away from the people that have the balls. Please! Nah, I'm gonna die here, though. Okay, W charming pose. Why are we 99 in keys, bro? Oh my god. That's all right. It's all right. It's all right. People can still 99, but it's not. It's just not good anymore, guys. 99 keys is not good. I there's usually always one person running time patrollers, bro. And if you have me in your game, I am most likely running it. <laughs> all right. So this is where our build comes in a little more handy. We got the uh, two range stuns that we can. Uh, Stun from a distance and be okay with. There was a couple people running away from my man that had the Dragon Ball, so... I also, I saw someone throw up a zipline for us. That was kind of a W move. Uh, when we were fighting, I, I, I had that chance to take the zipline and be safe. Alright. Really? Really, bro. Why are you going for me, bro? Alright, I think we're actually dead here. I, I think he actually fights around here and we die. He heard me moving. Oh, that's so frustrating, dude. Because, like, he should be on the time machine right now, not focused on random people here. Please finish me off. Please finish me off. Alright. Good, good, good. He might camp me because I'm a level 3. We'll see if someone tries to res me. But we do have Shenron. And hopefully Shenron in that direction. I mean, hopefully someone goes to pick me up. Alright, at least the level one's doing his job. And this zipline guy's not doing much to help me, even though he could be. So I think I'm dead here. And right, now he comes. Yeah, so unfortunately, if I didn't go down, I would be able to show the power of like the ranged stuns, um, stopping him from destroying the time machine. But Shenron should be here. Maybe I can do it right here. Nope, he's gonna come try and kill me. That's actually hilarious. Let's see if I can land some ranged stuns over here. Honestly, should be on the time machine. But I just, having no barrier is scary, so. Oh. That is a crazy grapple. Welcome. Thank you. Let me actually be annoying here. Oh no! I was gonna. I was gonna jump out to this guy. All right, W team, let's go. Your allies knocked out. Can you save them? 
I was gonna try and stop him before he could do that or finish him. So as you can see, we can jump out and move around. Try not to get like lasered because I don't have a barrier. You think I can time the shoe? Oh, I'm crazy! He's stunned! Shenron, you could have got some damage there. Oh, that was such a good shoe timing. Is there a barrier down there? No. I'm definitely not opening that one until, uh... Wow, he gets hit from there? Taking this first, over everything. Someone took the one drink. Is that it? Right there. Yeah. Well, no. Alright, hold up. Time the stuns, time the stuns, time the stuns together, boys. <laughs> Rail's really hurting him here. Body change me, bro. That. Body changed me. Wait, waste your time, bro. Can we stop doing that, please? <laughs> I mean, obviously, it's impossible to tell like when someone's gonna stun, but throwing a Gatling gun wasn't gonna do anything off them. Should have just like let me stun. But yeah, that's funny. That's funny. Wait, actually, how did the Gatling gun just get rid of all of his armor? Did he have half of it left? Usually it doesn't do that. Shu doesn't take armor off, does it? I, I Regardless, really that was a really good team. Uh, team played really, really well. Um, a lot of people died, unfortunately. Uh, Shenron did well, you know, keeping them occupied. So yeah, W team, W team. A couple things I could have done better, right? If I if I didn't die, I think we could have played it a little more smoother. Um, when people, when everyone rezzed me, that's when like a lot of people went down. Um, I think people got up, but you know. If I didn't go down, I think it would have been a little smoother. So, hey, GG, uh, very, very good game. Uh, well played by everyone. I think, honestly, I probably played played the worst. So, yeah. All right, let's play one more. But you guys can see, like, the jump pad and range stun. You can see how great it is to kind of be very safe in the air while still being able to kind of glide over the time machine, shoot stuff, or even help Shenron. You saw me throw the Krillin shoot. I mean, that was just skill right there, throwing the Krillin shoot. But... Unfortunately, Shenron didn't do anything to capitalize on the damage, which is fine. He was hugging the time machine, so. But yeah, let's uh, let's play another game. All right, game two. Let's see if we don't make that dumb mistake again. I I mean, I don't remember if I had grapple when I died the first time. <laughs> I might have, but maybe I was being a little greedy with the jump pad. I'm not sure. But let's try and do our best and uh, help out the team. I've set a super time All right, nothing down well here, unfortunately. Supplies. Here's how to launch. Ooh, Find no the landing keys. delay boost. Then place them in the right spots. You found a power key. Go slot it. Okay, I don't know why he would just ignore this stuff, but that's okay. I feel like I'm off to a very bad start. Ugh. Usually there's some stuff in the in that cave right there. Okay, a large kinda boot me back up. Feel good. Dang, someone's finding all the keys. Please don't have a uh, no oh, there was nothing there. Okay. I'm gonna be done here. Great. You know what to do with that key. We are finding keys left and right, man. I'm gonna go down here because generally that's where most of my supplies are, and no one's taking it. So let's go. I did hear a sim there, but it's all right. I'll take that over the scouter. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, all these. Hey, great! You found another power key. Use it quick. All these damn briefcases, man. I hate them. 
you my savior. I don't really have like good luck with the briefcases. Like sometimes, like I'll get the super cooldown drink, but I feel like that's one out of every like Welcome. thirty Thank I pick you. up. All right. Now, it's time to. All right, Raccoon trash talking over here when we literally just need one more key. Well, I, it's not trash talking, but you know what I mean. Uh oh. I'll probably take a barrier. That's a new power uh -oh. Place it now. Why is he looking over here? Shouldn't he should have saw the guy leave, right? He knows where the B key is, maybe he's just wait. Oh god. Time to go. Yeah, put in that key, baby. Oh, he's kicking, he's kicking. Put in the key, put in the key. Ah, nice try. I wonder how close it was. I saw your ass. I can't, I can't, I can't do it. What the? It wouldn't let me do it. Why, bro? Like, there's there are people near you and he's going for my ass. Alright, whatever. W team, though. I literally did nothing. <laughs> but hopefully I can uh, make up for it by using my range stuns and my floating device to stop him from getting the time machine. Someone is down. Can you help them? Oh, did he send you demon? Hold up. Oh, I can't. Oh, you are in the worst place, bro. I don't know why you're complaining, bro. You sent it. It might have been an accident, but. Okay. Shenron's here, so. Again, gotta do my job. Use this floating butt. Oh, never mind. Oh my god, bro. Like, <laughs> I don't know if you can't make it up, bro. What causes him to get hit by the Saiyan pod and then look in my direction? What about the dude that hits you with the Saiyan pod? <laughs> Why aren't you hitting him? Oh my gosh, bro. It's so funny sometimes. I like to look for a stun here to help him. I wanted to wait, but he already, uh, to help. Make good use of them. he already got meleeed, so I didn't need to use my thing. Supplies are coming in. Welcome. Oh. There we go. Oh no. Oh, right. Is he gonna go for the Shenron, or should I just? Oh my god, bro. I honestly, like, I didn't even notice it was Goldo. Isn't that crazy how he just randomly hit me, too? I'm playing so greedy here. That miss, bro? Alright, let me help this guy. Oh my god, he's flying so fast. Okay. Ow. He killed. Oh, I mean, we're winning this, anyways. He wasted way too much time. Ow. I got the stuns though, we chillin'. I like how he's still trying to... <laughs> I 
I shouldn't have used two, but hey, we got it. All right, not the best game to showcase, but I mean that was a quick one too. I mean, we he rushed him like crazy. We had Shenron. He also was just too focused on Shenron, didn't do anything about the time machine. So I don't know, but yeah, you guys get the point, right? Uh, just they're really good. The two ranged suns with the with floating device, they're good in general. They're I, again, they're not technically should be used for combat there was a lot of instances uh in these fights where you know they would just miss straight up regardless of how fast they were uh they're somewhat hard to hit you just got to have a little bit more skill and timing and aim uh but uh they are still very very good um as support from a distance right that's what i love about them um level one on our team dang uh, but yeah, guys, hey, that's it. Uh, let me know what you think of them together or just in range stunts in general. And I will see you guys later. Have a great Wednesday. Bye.